Good morning, everybody. Happy Sunday, the 28th of January, 2024. Man, that's a lot of numbers out there. <laughs> trying, to, trying to keep the old brain right focused on uh, all, the, all those numbers. 128.24. I'm going to play that for a lot of today. Anyway, I do hope your day is off to a nice start today. You know, one of the big raps on uh, me is that uh, I'm pretty much impervious to eating, uh, you know, like food that my, okay, let's face it, I may, a food that's expired, not just a couple of weeks ago, a couple of months ago, but uh, almost a decade, <laughs> a decade ago, to wit, once we had a package of Farmer, Farmer John hot dogs here from uh, 2011, yum, yum. And it was the only thing that kind of backed up the system a little bit. And I think, okay, that might have not have been the smartest thing to do. But when it comes to uh, food preservatives, I have absolute and total faith in the state of the art of the, of the food preservation business. I tell people like, okay, it's not the food reservation business, but you know, when, uh, when uh, <laughs> Commander Scott right in his uh, ship, whatever the hell it was, got crushed and iced or whatever, and uh, they're eating blubber and, and uh, going a thousand miles and pulling a sledge and up mountains and the whole crew survived, right, because of the brilliance of this. I mean, come on, man, on some of these Arctic expeditions, they find canned goods from like... <clears throat> 90 years ago. Oh, these are good. <laughs> You'll get some guy open it up. Oh, man, this is excellent. If you can get past all the lead that was used to seal them and the uh, high possibility of lead poisoning and everything like that. But um, here, you know, I have a lot of confidence. But the story I'm t today kind of really caught my eye because have I donated things to food banks before? Yes, I, I have, right? I've, I've donated cases and cases of uh, items before, but I don't think I would ever uh, slide something in there that uh, from the back of the cabinet that might be, uh, might pass the system because, uh, right, everybody's uh, gut is not the cast iron device mine is and uh, they might be delicately featured. <laughs> It might not go down too good. But this food bank in England received a donation of this. Uh, and the whole thing is just, I don't know, it's disgusting. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I honestly don't know what's more disgusting. The, the, the fact that uh, this, uh, the food pantry got a donation of food that was 20s from 1998, 26 years old a glass jar of some sauce or the fact that the sauce itself was some kind of onion cheese <laughs> some kind of onion cheese goo joy juice combination for like I mean, what the hell do you have that on strawberries <laughs> strawberries cream and onion and cheese uh, a sauce i don't know it's horrifying <laughs> it's just absolutely it's horrifying to me uh, anyway, I'm going to put the link to the story uh, <clears throat> down there. I won't be, uh, uh, if I'm live streaming tonight, it won't be until uh, later. I'm meeting a family member uh, down on the way to, uh, down on the way to the city there. So I'm going to have kind of a, a, a very nice day. Uh, but I'm going to wish the rest of you a very, very pleasant and uh, happy Sunday and uh, I will see you around later. I'm also going to put up the video. I think it's about 28 minutes long of the making of the lemon meringue pie and it's not just for people uh, that you know are interested in a lemon meringue pie but there's also some really good tips for uh, you know making pie crusts and things like that which is exceedingly difficult for a lot of people, when they throw up their hands, it all breaks up and crumbles. You know, you might enjoy, you might get something out of it. And it might stimulate you to uh, donate 28 years. No, I didn't. It might stimulate you <laughs> to go clean out the back of your, go clean out the back of your shelf. Okay, you know, there's terrifying things lurking back there. But it might encourage you to try doing a little baking. I'm going to close it out for now. If you're not subscribed, subscribe, hit the bell for all notifications. And of course, thumbs up are always appreciated. Thanks, everybody, and enjoy your.
Sun.